Good evening. The word of the day is Delta. I don't know if you've ever experienced a hurricane. I've never been at the coast and experienced a hurricane. But right here where I live, I live through Hurricane Hugo. Most folks never expected it to come inland like it did. But it came blasting across the state of South Carolina and right over Cleveland County where I live. I laid in the bed that night at my mom and dad's house and listened as the winds howled outside and wondered what was being torn up. I lay there and listened to shingles being ripped off the roof and knew that we had a bad storm and knew that the power had gone off. My mom worked at a nursing home at that time and she was called in to work. She got up because she was sleeping in the basement and did not realize it was anything like what it was, and got in a car and tried to drive to the nursing home. I say tried, she actually made it there. But as she traveled out the highway to the nursing home, she kept seeing all these blue flashes. She at first thought it was odd lightning, but she soon realized it was transformers on power poles that were being torn apart and were exploding. She later said, I had no idea what I was going into. Twice I've been to help people clean up after hurricanes. I've been to the coast of North Carolina to help one of my friends, and I went with a group from church to Laurel, Mississippi, and helped clean up after Hurricane Katrina. It's all kind of mess and all kind of devastation. So tonight, as you think about Hurricane Delta, it came ashore just 14 miles from where Hurricane Laura came ashore in Louisiana. There are people there who probably have nothing left. So I think tonight would be a good time to say a little prayer for those folks down there. And if you can, donate some way to send some relief to those people because I'm sure there's people there with nothing left. If you've never lived through a hurricane, you don't know what it's like. I hope you never have to live through one, but if you ever do, you'll understand just a little bit more of what a hurricane, the forces of nature, are capable of. I hope you don't have to go through it, and I hope you have a great day.